Ani, updated, December 9, 2018, 247 IST, Washington, D.C., USA, December 9th, Ani, United States President Donald Trump on Saturday reiterated his stand over the wrapping up of special counsel Robert Mueller's investigation on alleged Russian meddling in the 2016 presidential election as there was no collusion, taking to his Twitter handle, Trump, while terming the probe as a witch hunt, said that there was nothing impeachable, this is collusion illusion, there is no smoking gun here. At this late date, after all that we have gone through after millions have been spent, we have no Russian collusion. There is nothing impeachable here. Time for the witch hunt to end, the U.S. president tweeted, after two years and millions of pages of documents and a cost of over $30 million, no collusion, read another tweet. Trump has been a vocal critic of Mueller's investigation and has repeatedly called it a witch hunt and unnecessary. Mueller is currently investigating the possibility of Russian interference in the 2016 presidential polls and a possible collusion between Moscow and Trump's electoral campaign. Resonating similar sentiments, Trump's attorney Rudy Giuliani asserted that Mueller's late Friday dump demonstrates yet again no evidence connected to president. Fake news coverage can't change the reality that Mueller's late Friday dump demonstrates yet again no evidence connected to president. It also indicates SDNY is asking that Cohen receive a four-year prison sentence, longest so far, because as we have said he's still lying, Giuliani wrote on his Twitter handle while referring to the U.S. attorney for the Southern. District of New York, SDNY, earlier on Friday, Mueller said that former Trump campaign chairman Paul Manafort had lied about five major issues, including his contact with administration officials, after the latter agreed to cooperate with the prosecutors. The federal special counsel in a court filing informed that Michael Cohen, Trump's former lawyer, was in contact with a Russian since 2015, who offered political synergy with Trump's election campaign. According to Al Jazeera, filings via prosecutors from New York and the Trump-Russia Special Counsel's Office laid out details of the cooperation of Cohen for the first time. In one of the filings, Mueller detailed how Cohen spoke to a Russian, claimed to be a trusted person, in the Russian Federation who could offer the campaign, political synergy, and, synergy on a government level. Prosecutors also asserted that Cohen should receive, substantial, prison time, for several federal crimes, despite cooperating with law enforcement investigations, which also includes Mueller's Russia probe. In August, Cohen was pleaded guilty to paying adult film star Stormy Daniels as part of a non-disclosure agreement over her affair with Trump. He further claimed that he orchestrated the payments at Trump's direction. He also pleaded guilty in connection with eight criminal charges. Cohen is set to be sentenced on December 12 by a New York court, Annie.